Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So the first cumulative update for, of Patch Tuesday for this year of 2022 is now rolling out for Windows 10. And that is KB5009543, which rolled out on the 11th of January 2022. And if you are on Windows 10 version 21H2, your OS build will now be 19044.1466. And if you are on 21H1, that'll be 19043. And if you're on 20H2, that'll be 19042. And just remember now that, as a side note, that Windows 10 uh, version 2004 has reached its end of servicing. So if you are still on that operating system and version of Windows 10, you will need to update to a, a newer, recent, later version of the operating system to carry on receiving the latest updates. Now, there are no bug fixes in this latest update to Windows 10, as there was no optional update that rolled out um, at the end of last month in December 2021 due to the holiday season. So this is purely a security update fix with a couple of little other improvements and there's actually not too much to mention in this um, first update um, for Windows 10 of this year 2022. Now those little highlights basically are in, um, according to the release notes it updates a known issue that affects um, Japanese input method e editors that's IME for short and um, text you enter might appear out of order or the text cursor might move unexpectedly um, when you are using the Japanese input method. And then also it updates security for your Windows operating system. And these Patch Tuesday security updates address a lot of security issues um, in all aspects of the different products and services of Microsoft and especially those of the Windows operating system. And there's, there's also um, over and above the security updates, there's also another little improvement where it says addresses an issue that prevents Active Directory AD for short attributes from being written properly during a lightweight directory access protocol um, modify operation when you make multiple attribute changes. So as mentioned, this is mainly a security update and just carries one or two of those little improvements as mentioned. And then obviously, as always, it updates and makes quality improvements to the servicing stack, which is um, responsible for the Windows update process on your machine. Now, if we head over to Windows Update, um, this will be downloaded and installed automatically onto your device as Patch Tuesday cumulative updates are mandatory compulsory updates. And for whatever reason you, you um, don't want to or are having problems installing it through Windows Update, you can always head over to the Microsoft Update Catalog to download and install the update manually if um, you are having issues through Windows Update itself. And once installed, you can just head over to View Update History and cumulative update for Windows 10 version 21H to KB5005943. And I received my update today on the 12th. So as mentioned, it's there's no optional updates, bug fixes that have rolled over from uh, last month due to there be no C release last month. And over and above all the security updates, it just has those one or two little improvements as mentioned. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.